it's possible to deal with the application of scales in GCAD plus landscape drawings in a number of different ways. I should not really need to reiterate that everything that you draw in model space is full size. So this is a, an imperial drawing, a drawing using decimal feet as its base unit. So if I pick our distance tool and measure across the driveway like so, I get a distance of some 17 feet. What I've done in this drawing is brought in a, a block, which I've called bar. It's just a scale bar. So it has 0, 5, 10, and 20 feet. So that gives anyone who looks a plot from this drawing an internal scale. But it is possible to go back here into layout space and use the modify and set fixed scale in layout. The first prompt says select the floating viewport, then hit the enter key. I'm working in imperial units, so I'll type an I for the shortcut and uh, we'll try 1 over 64 as a fixed scale and you may notice that the uh, viewport itself shifts. Um, I have a problem in that the viewport currently is overlapping the viewport holding the plant schedule so I'll just move that in and what I've done in fact is inadvertently applied a fixed scale to the second viewport so I'll take fixed scale off for that one that that will enable me to double click in here and just expand that magenta border and then display that on the layout and deactivate the viewport so we now have a fixed scale of 1 to 64, zoom extends on this border here. Notice that I've applied a color 255 to it, so that's the border frame, if you like, will be white on a white background, so we won't see it. So I have a fixed scale of 1 to 64, but I've got the additional benefit of an internal scale there. So I really should put some text down in here under the logo where I would have site details, and I could say, uh, panel on left, fixed scale 1 to 64, uh, but I prefer to use that internal scale so that's available on all layout sheets that are printed from this design. So setting fixed scale, it's your choice. You can do it or not, and 